So I painted my nails today a matte purple. How do we feel about that? How do we feel about matte fingernail polish? I need your opinions. Let me know what you think about it. And on to the regular scheduled programming. Hey y'all, welcome back to Brooks Beauty Blog. This week is all about jeans. I love a good cotton dress like any other southern girl. Fall, you have to succumb to wearing jeans more often and we have to kind of get away from our beloved short cotton dresses. But I am here to help you figure out what jeans are must-haves for the fall. You know me, I tend to what I like to call ball on a budget. So I think that everyone should have three types of jeans in your closet. And you can mix and match, dress up, dress down, do whatever you want with these three types of jeans. These three types of jeans are skinny, boot cut, and flare. I think these are all three classic cuts of jeans and you can dress them up, dress them down, you can do whatever you want for any occasion. I have on a t-shirt right now, I'm going to put on all three types and I'm going to show you how you can dress them up and dress them down very easily and how you can ball on a budget too. Let's check out three types of jeans. I'm going to try all three on for you right now. Alright, so these are my super skinny jeans. They are tight all over, they're really like... They flatter your form. They kind of hug in all the right places. And I really like the dark wash because, I mean, who doesn't like the slimming dark wash? And I have them on right now with my Chuck Taylor, so you can wear them with tennis shoes too. You can also wear these with boots because, duh, it's the fall. So let me show you that now. And here we are in boots. The reason why skinny jeans are super important for your fall wardrobe is because of your boots. They tuck in your boots and it keeps from bunching up and it's a nice fit to make your leg look skinny on down into your boots and it's just a clean, clean look. You can also wear them with booties which are really in this fall. So let me show you that now too. Ready? And here we are with booties. I have tight rolled my jeans twice. I've doubled the roll and it gives me a small ankle area where you see a tiny bit of skin and then I have these cute fringe booties that are super in this fall and I just love booties I think they're a nice way to dress up an outfit if you put these booties on with these jeans and then you wear like a colored plain colored t-shirt kind of tuck it in the front put on a little belt with it you dress up an outfit and all you have on is jeans and a t-shirt so these are why you need a pair of good skinny jeans in your wardrobe this fall. Now let's go to the boot cut jeans. And these are my boot cut jeans. These are classic. They never go out of style. These I love. They have the, the flat front on them and they have the pockets on the back with a little detail. It gives you a little uh, accentuation back there if you may. So I love these jeans. They're a medium wash, a little bit on the darker side but you can wear them with tiny heels like I have on or with boots, hence the name boot cut and they just hit the ground perfectly they're just so classic these can be dressed up, they can be dressed down they are just the perfect cut basically for anything so I, I definitely recommend that everyone have a pair of boot cut jeans in their closet these can be dressed up as well so now we'll move to the third essential pair of jeans which is the flare jeans and these are my flare jeans. These are my favorite flare jeans I own because they have a little stretch to them. A good pair of flare jeans when you are looking will have a little stretch to them because they'll be tighter at the top and they'll be looser in the bottom. These have a good pocket on the back where they're just enough stretchy where they're comfortable but they're tight enough to give you the illusion of having the skinny thigh area which we all of course want. And then they go flare out at the bottom. I have on a pretty big wedge with them right now because mine are a little long. But these are definitely my favorite pair of flare jeans. They pretty much go with anything as well. If you're doing a flare jean, you usually want to stick with a tighter top. Usually like a fitted t-shirt or a fitted tank top or a fitted sweater. These are super good in the winter because you're all wearing sweaters. 
or cardigans or anything like that. So if you have the flare jean that's tight at the top and big at the bottom and you have on your sweater, it's a perfect fall outfit. Also, when you're buying jeans, I have jeans that I've bought for $20 and I have jeans that I've bought for $200. If you are buying essential pairs of jeans, go ahead and invest in a good pair. I have pairs that I bought for $40 from Urban Outfitters. One of the cheaper brands that I like are BDG jeans from Urban Outfitters. They are skinny most of the time and they are pretty well made. They hold up for a couple years. So if you're looking to ball on a budget, then go for that kind of jean. Also, um, Kohl's and some of the discount stores has a lot of name brand jeans for about a fourth the price. So if you get lucky and they have your size, definitely look there. But if you're looking to only have a couple of pair of jeans in your closet, it's nice to invest in a good pair because they last for years and years. What brand name you like is up to you. You kind of have to try them on, see how they look on you, see how they fit your butt, your thighs, your legs, and kind of see what looks best on your body type. I have certain types that I like, but they may not be the same kind that will look good on you. So all you have to do is go and try and see what looks best on you. And for my obsession of the week this week, it is these fringe boots. You saw me with these on with my skinny jeans earlier, and I love them. Tasseled booties seem to be super in this fall. I've always loved fringe anything, but these are super cool. Um, they are a light brown color. I got them for $40 at a boutique here in Birmingham called Fabric. These have a little wedge heel, so they're comfortable, it's not too tall, and it's a lot to stand on. So yeah, get you a pair of booties this season, and if you like fringe, add some fringe to them. These are really fun, and as you saw with my skinny jeans, they are very easy to wear, and I have worn them actually with a dress, with a romper, and with jeans. So I have worn these any possible way you can. So they are very versatile and yeah, wear booties this fall. They're so easy to go with everything. Well guys, thanks for coming back this week. I hope the information I gave you was at least a little helpful and will help you transition your wardrobe into fall. Um, if there's something you would like for me to talk about, please let me know in the comments below. I have been doing a lot of makeup videos recently, so I thought I would do a little clothing and fashion video this week to mix it up. So let me know if there's something you want me to talk about. I would love to do that. Um, if you are watching me on Facebook, find me on YouTube under Brooke Nicole and subscribe to my channel and you will never miss one of my videos. If you like this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up. Um, and then you'll let me know that you like my fashion videos and that you think I'm doing a grand job. But thanks for coming back this week, and I hope you'll come back later. See you later, guys. Bye.